Hello, everyone. Can you guys see me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you see me? What's going on, Tara? Please share this video for me, guys. All right, so I'm going to be doing a project share for a design team, a once upon craft upon a star, okay? I showed you guys this kit the other day. I think it was last week or so. I got, my days are so mixed up, guys. I don't know about you guys, but sometimes it feels like days have passed and only a day has gone by. So I'm like everywhere. Hi, Rocky. Hello, everyone. Can you guys hear me and, and um see me well? It says zero, but I see people coming in chat. So weird. So this is an amazing kit that um, I received from Star. And her shop is Craft Upon a Star. Can one of my moderators please, please, please link Craft Upon a Star on Instagram? This is an Instagram seller. I'm going to go ahead and take some of the items out. I'm going to take all this stuff out so I can show you guys in case you missed that live. I'm not going to go into detail too much. I'm just going to quickly show you guys all the stuff that came in the kit. It is so fully loaded. This is one of the biggest kits I've ever seen. Like, seriously. So let me just put everything here and then we'll go over some of the things in the box. Hi, Luz. Hi, Catherine. Hello, Sonia. Hello, everyone. Hootie hoo. We're on my night owls. Hi, Beth. Let me get some um, owl emojis in the chat. So, guys, this is a Craft Upon a Star project team, uh, design team project. Okay, so the first thing which I'm in love with, hello, DV. And DV is part of the design team as well. So, you guys, make sure that you check out her project shares as well. I'm just going to go ahead and link the shop. I'm going to link dv's channel um so you guys can check out her upload and then yeah i'm gonna put all that stuff in the description box below so this is one of my favorite things from the kit okay now not only do you get like a little sample you know like a lot of times in the kit you only get like a few things um you get a full brand new roll of tool which i am so thrilled about it is so pretty guys it's got these gold foiled bows and i believe that she lets you pick a couple colors she asked me whether I wanted the teal, the white, or the pink. And y'all know I had to grab the pink. Come on now. I had to grab the pink. So you get a full brand new roll of tool in this kit. Tara, the scallop dye you sent, Tara, is that in your shop? That's an alley dye. So you get this tool. You get this set, the set of macarons. Macarons. Hi, Scrap Goodness. And these actually open it up and you can put goodies in here, okay? Now, um, can you guys, did you guys link the shop? Put uh, once Craft Upon a Star, please, one of my mo moderators. Link the shop. Now, this is going to be, her store is going to be opening tomorrow. Tomorrow are when the kits are in sale. But I had to harass her. Hey, Natalie. And I was like, um, I need my night hours to order. So all of my night owls, you better go jump in um, Craft Upon a Star's DM and say, hey, Poochie sent me and I need a kit. Okay, so you guys, you guys can have a kit. I don't want her to sell out and I don't want you guys to miss out on this amazing kit because we're going to be playing with this stuff. Okay, guys. So I got, we got the macarons. We got the tool, full pack of tool. There's a bunch of cabochons here. Look at how cute this little uh, kitty donut one is. Thank you so much, DV. You got some of these cupcakes. You got some of these cute little cacti and their bohos. I'm just going to quickly go over this because we already went through this in a live. I just want to make this, 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 this video specifically about her. I want to show you guys everything you get. All these little airplanes. Now, I believe this is the garden party themed one. So, it's a lot of things to go with garden party. The colors are there and all that good stuff. The flowers. You get these little bows. There's so much stuff here, guys. These, you, okay, now that's another thing that I want to mention. Like, you know, sometimes with kits, you only get a few things. Um, there's, these are fully loaded, okay? Like, look at these that are left. And I um, made a few, I put some on bales. Let me grab them here on the side. So, you don't get, like, five or six little things. Like, there's a lot in these bags, guys. Okay, which I can appreciate. I don't know about you guys. 
but I can appreciate, especially for the money that is spent, I can appreciate a fully loaded kit, okay? So all of these plus these, hey, Gabby, in this package, these little bears, look how many you get. You get a ton, okay? And every single package, it is fully loaded. Look at all these cherries. These are so damn cute. I can't wait to play with these. Now, I wasn't able to play with this kit like I really, really wanted to because I had to hurry up because the launch is tomorrow. So I had to jump on here with my night owls and we had to make something because I'm like, uh-uh, my night owls got to get, they got to get it in. So these bows here, we get the pink and there goes Star right there, guys. She is the shop owner of Craft Upon a Star, okay? So you get these and again, fully loaded, guys. There's not like four or five, it's fully loaded, okay? You get this chain, which I have not seen this chain anywhere. It is really thick. It's sturdy, and they're beautiful colors. Beautiful colors. Okay, we got so many collections to match these colors right here. You cannot go wrong, okay? So we got that. We got these appliques, these butterfly ones. Look at how many are in there, guys. This thing is fully loaded, okay? Star, uh, let me know what the price is. I, I know she said she was thinking 50 plus shipping or 55 shipped. I'm not sure. She can go ahead and let me know. But, guys, I've seen kits that are, you know, um, a little less than that or whatever. But these are fully loaded, okay? Look at all these charms. You don't get five charms. You get, like, a lot. Like, look. It's fully loaded. So, it is so worth the price, okay? And, of course, we always want to support small business. There's these. And there's even more. Like I said, I put some of them on cabochons. I mean, I put some of them on the clear bells that you can get from uh natalie shop pretty mix studio you just glue these on the back and they become charms okay so again these are loaded 55 dollars shipped okay you're not gonna play pay extra shipping it is 50 to 5 dollars shipped in the u.s look at all these okay again fully loaded got these hearts did i say hi Cheryl's? and i believe that that is it okay so let me put on my get my shit together and i'll get my shit together okay let me get my shit together because I'm going to share with you guys what I created for my design team. Me and DV are on her, which is uh, DV Love on Instagram. We are on her design team. And so I can't wait for her to share her stuff as well. So I'm going to be linking her. Let me clear my desk off so we can get into these projects. And not only am I going to show you my projects, but we're going to create one on the live tonight. So I hope that y'all are ready to craft with me. Go get you some popcorn on La Cubana. She here. Hello to anyone. If I missed anyone, um, get your popcorn, get your drinks. You had a long day at work. Kick them feet up and let's get our craft on. Okay. Okay. Let me get all this stuff out the way. Like star, you, you did a good job with that kit girl. So my first project share are these vellum little shaker envelopes. So here's the front. And um, she asked me what theme that I wanted. And I said garden party. So this is a garden party theme thing uh, kit. So I play with garden party with it. So this opens. I did a little Velcro on there. There goes a little cabochon. I got my little garden party shaker mix. My little pieces from the, um, the collection. And then it's also sewn over here. And I use the tool from her kit. Look at how beautiful, guys. It's so gorgeous. And I housed a little tiny mini memory dex card. Look at how cute. It's so itty bitty. It's itty bitty bitty. So I put that in there. You can put whatever you want in here. Hey, sis, what's going on? So that's one that I created. Oh, and you also get this box in the kit. You get this box right here. It is an embellishment box, guys. And it's pink. It's a butterfly. It's beautiful. And it is perfect for a garden party. I forgot to mention that you also get this. Damn, I hope I'm not missing nothing else. So there's only one of these boxes in there, and it's, it, it is beautiful, guys. Like, look, this is how I embellished it, okay? I haven't put any goodies in here. If I have time, we'll do it on the live. You can throw some beads in here. You can put some charms in here. You can put some trim in the middle. You can do whatever you want, okay? And so what I did on this was I ruffled some of that tool trim. If you guys don't know how to ruffle trim uh, tool, 
with your sewing machine i have a video on my channel okay so i will link that in the description box below it's for beginners because i'm a beginner sewer okay um so i ruffled this trim and i just glued it down i used some hot pink thread to like get like a little pop or whatever i used her little appliques these are gorgeous guys like i want to do more with this but i was running out of time um and then i did a chipboard that i had already pre-sewn before okay so just really simple uh, embellishing on that one so there goes that we got that and then last but not least i made some little uh memory decks not memory decks paper clips embellishments hey dulce how are you hi anna i need i need a sewing machine yes girl you do hi mimi let me make sure i'm saying hi to all my night owls can i get some hootie hoos in the chats hootie hoo we got star here beth i said hi right Okay, I think I said hi to everyone. I'm so sorry if I missed you. So I created this embellished paper clip, okay? So I used some of the tool from the collection. There goes that little cabochon, some um, pieces from the garden party collection. This is actually a die from Urban Gems. Let me show you guys this die. I think this die is only like $3, 3 or $4. And if you use my code Pucci10, you'll get another 10% off. So this is perfect for garden party. Tara, I did say hi to you when I first started the video, girl. Tara, don't start your shit, girl. Don't start your shit. So urbangems.com. Use Pucci10 to get another 10% off. And what else did I do? I used some of this chain. And I just added some of the charms. So a really simple project. Again, I had to, like, do something quickly. But it's okay. Next time, like, I'm going to um, be well prepared and we're going to take our time. So I think it's really cute. I think it came out really cute. And on the side, you really can't tell. But I used this punch that I got from Monty. It was $5, guys. It's a bow punch. If you are a bow po, bow po, a bow hole, you need to have this bow in your stash. I also used it on the top of this little mini memory dex card right there. Okay, and that's only five bucks from Monty, who was the polka dot pine cone. I will try to link her as well. But this is what I made for my design team project. And then also, I sewed a lot of that. My favorite thing from the entire kit is this tool, guys. It's so pretty. Like, you have to get this. Star, are you giving people the option to pick their tool color? Um, I know she has white. I know she has mint. And I know she has the pink. So I just ruffled it with my sewing machine. And I just use it for texture, you know, on my projects. Thank you, guys. Hey, Lana. Thank you. And then I tried. Now, don't come for me. Y'all better not come for me, okay? Don't judge me. Judge your mama. Um, I tried my best to do, like, the crepe paper thing. It didn't come out the best. I got to practice. But I don't give a damn. Like, this is still going to get used. It's still going to get used. It's still going to be cute. And then this one... So I just was playing with this beautiful tool. I'm obsessed with this tool. You guys know I love me some tool. Everything else is the same. I just did. Some of it came out better than the, the rest. But yeah, all you need is a little bit for your projects. As you can see, I just glued it down and then put my little stuff on there. Hi, Denise. Thank you so much. Looks good to me. <laughs> Thank you, guys. So that is what I did with my design team stuff. So let me move. You guys, let me know what you think about these projects. We're going to go ahead and let's go ahead and do one of these. And then if we have time, we'll also make a little banner, okay? But you definitely want this kit, guys. You want to get this tool. This box is so cute. And I've seen this box in other places, but I have never seen it in pink. So, Star, you did an amazing job with this kit, girl. I'm so proud of you. Congratulations on your new shop. And, guys, again, if you're just joining, I wanted all my night owls to get dibs on this kit. You need to jump in her DM right now and put a little uh, owl emoji and let her know that you want the kit, okay? It is $55 shipped, and it is fully loaded. Let's move this to the side. So I went ahead and I prepped. I know I prepped more than this, but whatever. So I sewed this on these little vellum envelopes, and I got these from the polka dot pine, pine cone as well. I think these were like $2 for a pack, and it, there was a lot in there. So I just um, sewed, added my shaker mix. You know, I didn't seal it all the way. Put my shaker mix and then sealed it. And it came out really cute. I like the pop of color with the pink. 
So let's go ahead and embellish this. First, I want to put a Velcro. Oh, Lord. Every You guys already know the story of my life. Every time I think I have something together, I don't. Where are you, my Velcro? Where are you? All right. So you guys can get Velcro from Dollar Tree. This specifically is from Hobby Lobby. It was half off. And they are, I think they're a little smaller than the other ones, which I like that they're smaller. Yes, Star, congratulations, girl. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna stick this together. And I'm gonna cut out one. All I need is one. So how was everyone's day? What's going on, guys? It's so hot in Chicago, oh my God. I gotta come up with new analogies for it's hotter than whatever. One time we said it was hotter than a hoe and church. I don't know. It's hotter than, I don't know. I don't know what. Y'all tell me what it's hotter than in the comments, in the chat. So there goes a Velcro. And um, I did use one of these on my belly band before and it didn't stick well. But on this vellum, it sticks perfectly. So you do not have to add any glue, guys. So they're already stuck together. I'm just going to stick it here on the bottom. Star kit has always been, yeah, they have always been fire. And then I'm just going to go ahead and open that and stick it right there. Make sure you press it really good. And there goes your Velcro. Okay. There goes your Velcro. And I did make a little mini memory decks card to go in here. So maybe we should do that too. Let's see. I don't know. So far we're 16 minutes in. I don't want to make this live too, too long. I will put some timestamps. Um, maybe I'll put like when I'm showing the kit, a timestamp for the project share and a timestamp for the craft with me. So if people who could watch the replay, um, what am I looking for? So let's stick one of the cabotrons here and I have so many to choose from. Let's do the little hearts, the little whites, I mean flower. I really love this one though. This one's so pretty to me. But I wanted to have a little bit more dimension than that. So we'll do the white one. Hi, Clarissa. I'm so sorry if I'm missing anyone coming in. Come on, moderators, please let me know if I don't say hi to someone. What? You love the Arizona heat? The hell, Clarissa? Where did my little whites? Okay. So you guys gotta let me know what are your favorite things, the things that are sticking out to you in this kit. Mine, it's so, it's so many things, but definitely the tool takes the cake, baby. Oh my God, how does hell in Jersey, girl. Nasty Storm broke a transformer at the hospital. We just moved 10 moms. Oh my God, and 10 babies to a different floor because no power or AC. Oh no, girl. Guys, let's say a prayer for Denise and that hospital and those mothers. No way. All right. So we have these cute little cabochons. I'm going to use this one because it ha it's more thicker. And I just want people to be able to, like, grab it. You know what I mean? Like, you can lift this up right here and know to lift it up. All right. So let me put a little bit of glue. Let's stick it, like, right there. Okay. I got to go check out Ava, guys, because baby girl is just too grown. And for all I know, she's, like, cooking on my stove right now, making herself dinner. I don't know what the hell she's doing. Give me one second, guys. I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. False alarm, guys. She didn't steal the keys to the car and drive to Baby's R Us. She was sleeping. Okay. So we got our little cabochon going on. And let's go ahead and embellish this. If you guys don't sew, you can definitely still do this. You can use that glue method that I showed you, shared with you guys so many times. And you can put like trim under it to cover up the glue spots and stuff. So you can still achieve this look without sewing. So I got my stickers here. What are y'all talking about? Lillian's on here. Hi, Lillian. Hi, Angel. Who else did I miss, guys? Tell me in the chat who I missed because I'm not going to scroll up. I've been loving, loving, loving the butterflies. The black and the, the white is so cute here. Let's go ahead and do a sentiment. So let's stick the hello. Okay. Let's stick the hello there. Just like that. These stick perfectly on this vellum. They look so cute, guys. Hi, Scrap Goodness. How are you? Oh, that's you, Scrap Goodness. Girl, you, you fooled me with that damn picture. Lillian, I'm so used to your um your other picture from, <laughs> from Instagram, girl. Okay. So let's do some florals here. And let's use some of these. As you can see, I love my florals from these collections. They are my go-tos. Let's do this one. Girl, you fooled me with that damn picture. I already said hi to you. <laughs> Stick that right there. So it doesn't take a lot to embellish these. Let's do this yellow one. I'm loving the gold from um, Garden Party. The yellow from Garden Party, guys. Like, I'm usually not a gold person. I mean, a yellow person. But I am in love. I'm loving the yellow, the pops of yellows in this collection. That's going to bother me. Let's see if we can pull this up. Yes, it is so pretty. Making me buying yellow paper and shit and all kind of yellow stuff. Like, what is going on? All right, let me see if I can pull that out without breaking it. All right. I want to move this more towards this way. There we go. And then let me stick just a little chipboard there. I want to just, you know, um, embellish this really simply. Let me move my sticker book. Okay, and we're going to grab a little piece of chipboard. It's so humid. Everything was moist. One of the main reasons we moved to Patience floor was so wet. We were shaking or skating on the floor imagine holding babies no girl that is so crazy yellow is growing on me hi tj you love yellow mangoes oh my god loose so we want to do a bow i always want to do a bow so we want to do a flore a flower Do we want to do this flower? I want to do another damn butterfly or a bow. The little cupcakes are so cute. Is it too big? Hmm. That one would have been cute if I didn't do the yellow there. I hope I didn't miss anyone. The bird, oh, the bird does sound cute. We got a bee, the bee is too big. I had a piece somewhere here on the side. I think it was a quail. Where the hell is it? Let me see. Ooh, fat ass bird. A little bird thick, she thick. Um, let me see, guys. God, these little chipboard pieces. Maybe just a heart. 
cupcake is so cute with the stitching. Thank you, guys. I kind of like the heart, guys. Because it's the black and white. Yellow flower is perfect. Cupcake is so cute with the stitching. The other one. If you are new to my channel, my night owls like to argue with me when it comes to embellishing shit. They like to fight with me all the time about what I should put down, where I should put it. They just like to fight with me all the time. Guys, I think I like the um the little heart, guys. Poochie, you're going to make me try this. Yes, girl, it's so easy to do. Where's that damn quail? I had a quail here, guys. It was so cute. And it wasn't no thick-ass quail either. There it goes. It's so pretty. I hope that this looks good. Because I really like this one. Is this a quail, guys? Damn it. It covers up so much. Damn you, you quail. Let me see. Can we make the quail work? Don't start that to the right to the left stuff. Do not the quail. No, not the quail. I like the quail loose. See what I'm talking about, guys? Yeah, no, the quail's too big. You lucky loose. The bee is too big. I'm doing the heart, guys. I'm doing the heart. This bird is too damn fat. Fat ass bird. Not gonna work. That bird would have been cute. It's a COVID uh bird. The bird is actually not that bad. Hmm. This bird been sitting in the house like us, crafting and eating. That's it. And yelling at kids. Dealing with baby kids all day. All right, we're going with the heart. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, we're going to go with the heart because I like the little black and white. Oh, my God, I'm obsessed with the butterflies on this. I used almost all my little butterfly chipboards on this one that I sold. I want to use the ones that I sold on. Then I'll open another pack. The quail with the flower, but it's under its butt. Yeah. The yellow is a sticker. It is from the Garden Party sticker book. We're going with this, guys. Okay. Okay. We're just going to go with that. Okay. I like that. That's cute. So there goes our little shaker thing. And let's go ahead and make a quick little, uh, what you call it, memory deck to go in there. Let me grab some scraps. So when you're making these little mini memmies, all you need is a two by two piece of paper. Let me see. Let me mark this. I can't cut straight worth shit. I don't feel like looking for my board. So it is what it is, guys. And of course, I don't have a pen. I have a thousand pens. But not when I need it. Here goes one. Hi, Penny. Penny's here. What's going on, Penny girl? So I'm going to mark it at two. Two by two. I'm actually going to make it a little bit bigger than two. Because I want to add that uh, bow top. I told you guys, I hate measuring... I hate it with passion. Do your magic, uh, Auntie Martha. I love it when it has lines that you can, like, follow. Okay. And then let's go ahead and do the little bow punch on top. Hi, Christina. Girl, I do got a scoreboard. What the hell? I got a lot of scoreboards. 
I just ain't got time to pull that big mug out. All right, so let's go ahead and punch this here. All right, that's fine. And let me see, that's two. I made this way too big. Let me cut this a little shorter. Thank you guys for the thumbs up. Tara, you got any GP sticker books in store? I see 33 and only 13 thumbs up. What's up with that? <laughs> Thank you guys for the thumbs up. Okay, so if you're just joining, guys, this is a design team project for Craft Upon a Star, um, who is Star's new shop on Instagram. It is that fully loaded kit that I showed on my channel a week ago. You guys can catch the replay um, and in the beginning, and I show everything in the kit. So right now, we're just using some of the stuff for the kit, and we are creating my design team projects. So I also, now you guys can use those square planner punch things. You can use just a regular uh, punch and just eyeball it. I'm just going to do it right there. Okay. I'm going to eyeball the other side. I've shown you guys how to make mini memory decks cards. I'll link that in my video as well. See, look, they look crooked, but whatever. Yes, girl, this, this bowl punch, Lillian, is from... Thank you so much, Penny. Um, Monty, the polka dot pine cone, and it's only five bucks. I don't know if she has any more, but you guys jump in her DM and just be like, hey, girl, I saw this bow punch that Bucci had, and I got to have it. So, yeah, this is not going to be perfect. This is too damn long for me. These look like little trees. So, I'm going to trim that. There goes our little mini memory decks, okay? Let me trim this a little more. I'm just making this little mini memory deck to go into our shaker uh, pocket envelope. I don't know what's going on in the chat. Monty, I just got hooked up with the button maker. Yes, girl. Did you use it yet? I don't know how to use it, girl. I haven't even tried. I have not had the time. But look, this is perfect. To give some rosettes in here, you could put your little uh, card in here. You could write a note to Tara, be like, "Hey, asshole, whatever, like whatever you want to do." But I'm gonna put a little mini memory decks card in there. Let's embellish that really quickly. I want to use up my sticker book. Let's do like um. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I have to use that. I have to use this, guys. It's so pretty. Monty's going to be my BFF. I, I'm going to have to block Monty because she's taking all my little coins. I'm going to start having to block everyone that's taking all my little coins. Because my husband's getting mad at me. Look at how pretty. Oh my god, these stickers are so pretty. <laughs> Girl, I got three scoreboards. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, let's do... I think I want to do the little bunny it would be cute. Let's do the bunny because she a boho. And these are the clear ones. So sometimes you want to back up my paper. I'm going to back it up on this. Do I have any pink scraps? I better have some pink scraps. What are you little pink scraps? Um... Damn it. Can never, there it goes. All this paper we have, guys, and I can never find my paper when I need it. So, oh, I forgot I got those. I have this powder from Monty, but I want this to be a little, uh, since I'm going to pop it up on phone tape, I do want it to be a little more sturdier. I don't even have a scoreboard. <laughs> now you know how I feel. Did you just say, hey, asshole? Yes, girl. She know that she an asshole, girl. 
star. You been MIA, girl. You need to catch up with the lives, baby girl, because I get all kind of packages from Urban Gems, and I get called all kind of assholes. I don't understand. It's because I'm Puerto Rican. I don't know. So let me fussy cut this because Luz likes to fussy cut. She likes to watch me fussy cut and judge me. So I want to put it on cardstock because I want to make it a little more sturdier. I know Luz is watching very closely. Like, nope, nope, nope. You, you missed the spot right there. Do you guys like to fussy cut? It is not my favorite thing to do, but sometimes <laughs> I'm reading a notification that just came up. Gotta do what we gotta do sometimes, guys. Okay, she cute. All right, so we're gonna put her. This is just a quick little one, two, three memory decks card. What did Lou say? Let me see what Lou said. Oh, that's so cute. Look at how cute, guys. Assholes come in many colors. I love to fussy cut. Heck no, hate it. I don't judge you. I judge your scissors. Oh, no, you did not come from my Auntie Martha scissors. Hey, Jessica. What's going on, Jess? All right. Let's see what else we want to put there. So have you guys been loving the garden party? Garden party? I'm just waiting for everybody to get sick of it. I don't think it's going to happen because it's so cute. I'm not sick of it yet. I'm still waiting on... um. Joanne's to come through, and I'm waiting on Urban Gems to come through with the puffy stickers. Let me see what else. Let's add some flowers. I'm gonna go ahead and stick her down. Get my phone. Yes, the digitals is available on AC Digitals. If you don't know, hi Nuana. I love Nuana's name. All right, so let me put some foam on your girl. What should we name her? I kind of want to name her like Rosie or something. What should we name the little bunny, Boho? <laughs> Somebody's leaving me funny comments. All right. Her ass on there. I think I want to call her Rosie. I'm fussy cutting the digitals for Garden Party right now. Why are you fussy cutting? Why are you using your silhouette? Little bunny boho. Oh, I like that. Yes, Beth. Little bunny boho. Let's stick her right there. She's looking like, I don't want to throw this ass in a circle. Okay, let's put some flowers because y'all know I love my flowers, okay? Loose, I can find so many other things to relax me other than fussy cutting, girl. Nope. Look at how pretty. My sausage fingers are not going to work with me. Let me grab my pliers. Right there. Right there. Then when you moved, right there. Okay. Anyone know where I can get a Hello Kitty collection? Not the Cricut one. I already have. I want to make Hello Kitty album. Look on Etsy, girl. There's a lot of um. There's a lot of Etsy sellers that sell. All these amazing uh, collections that you can print out and play with. See, I'm going to put one behind her, but then it's going to look like she's pooping a flower. And that's just not right. We don't want poopery. I know it's poopery, guys. 
um, let's just do a sentiment. So this is like really simple, just something to throw inside of there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this one that says things to remember. And I'm gonna back it up on some gold cardstock, gold glitter cardstock. Hi, Sam. Actually, I could do it on yellow. Let's do yellow. Um, I'm just grabbing some yellow scraps, guys. All right. Probably looks better on glitter paper, but don't matter. Damn it. Things to remember. Don't judge me. Judge your mama. Tried it. Tried Amazon, eBay, but it was like 40 for a 12 by 12 paper pad. Hey, Lala. Okay. Wondering what, let me see. What are you guys talking about? Do you guys know where I could find puffy stickers for garden party? No girl, it's nowhere. You can't find them no damn where. I'm very thankful that Joanne's is carrying the chipboard, but it's like, why you didn't carry the chipboard and the puffy stickers, Joanne's? Bye, Mimi. Thanks for joining, girl. Sorry, girl. You know our, us night owls would be up all night. Okay, that's gonna mess with me. Damn it, cut it too thin. I'm looking for some more of the project pads of Garden Party. I need some more of the project pads. Y'all jump in my DM when you find them. Okay. So we're just going to stick that there. Oh, I hate to cover it up. Because she's so cute. What did we say her name was again, Beth? too big it's gonna mess with me no no pick another one at one point they were selling it online you can get a shit i don't know i think the joanne's gonna like stock again we just keep buying the shit we won't give them a chance to Let's do love this. If I add the grass. What kind of grass are you talking about, Luce? We don't want the bunny to be smoking the devil's lettuce. She's a good girl. Little bunny boho, you said, right? You're going to say little bunny foo-foo. I didn't agree to that, Beth. So how many of you guys grabbed the kit from uh, Craft Upon a Star? I need to know. Let me know which one of y'all grabbed it. I can't wait to see what you guys make with this. You have to get your hands on this damn tool. Okay? You got to get your hands on this stuff. It's so cute. So when y'all place your order, and once again, her kits are going to be on sale tomorrow. But I want all my night owls to get dib, jump in that DM of Craft Upon a Star. And tell the tell her that you want this kit. It's fifty five dollars shipped. I showed you guys what's in it. It is like fully loaded for real. Damn it! 
can't cut straight worth of shit. Give her a second, guys. She will get back to you. Make sure you put a little night owl emoji. I'm going to be like, a uh, star. Everybody who put that little emoji, girl. And again, make sure you guys check out Stevie Loves Project Share. I think she's going to be posting it tomorrow. So I'm going to link her so y'all can go give her some love, show her some love. I think in September she might have a new kit. Luce, I know what grass you were talking about, girl. Don't try to clean it up now, okay? We know, girl. We know what grass you were talking about. All right. Well, let's see. It's better work, man. Damn it. I'm going with it. I don't care. I'm going with it. She tried to clean that shit up. No, I was talking about the grass that comes out the ground. We know, girl. <laughs> Little bunny boho. Where are Sandra and Tammy? Where are they in my A? Let me see. I'm just going to stick it there. We'll look it. All right. Sorry, Penny. I know you're underage, girl. Are you still on here, Penny? Guys, did you guys check out Penny and Anna's swap? Oh, my God. It was so bomb. All right, I think I want to stick like a flower there because it's going to irritate me. It's going to bug me. Bye, Lana. Um, I hope this one isn't too big. I'm just going to do this one. And where did my little yellow scrap go? No, I'm going to use a pink. Who else is leaving? What is their YouTube to see the swap? Uh, can someone link Penny and Anna's uh, video? Thank you so much, Cheryl's. All right. Damn it. Why I pick this the fussy cut? I'm just going to stick this one in between those two. Because I don't want my blending to look like it's shitting. Love this. You know what I'm saying? Still gotta make a paper clip. I'm taking too much time on this. Alright. I think Penny is only 16, guys. I can't believe that she crafts like that at 16. Like, what? That girl's talented. Is she still here? Penny, where are you, girl? Hi, Alicia. Where's the other Anna? She's not here? My night owls just be leaving me for dead. I don't know what's going on with my night owls. Okay. 
I'm just trying to stick a little piece of foam on here, guys. And I'm struggling with my sausage fingers. Whatever. Did I ruin it? Whatever. It's going like that. So there goes our little mini memory decks. Add some little diamond dots. Do some of your uh your foil flakes. And then where's the one that we just embellished? The hell did I do with it? I'm so terrible, guys. Here it goes. So we're going to stick this one in here. Girl, school is not out over here. My crumb snatchers are still at home. Driving me nuts. Eating all my food. Can you imagine when school's over with? Man, they're really going to eat my food. So there, it's going to go in there, a little Velcro, and there goes our little shaker project. Hi, Crafts and Create. Look how pretty. All right, now let's go ahead and do the little paper clip embellishment, and then we're going to get up out of here. It's already our man. Do you guys mind if we stay longer or what? Talk to me. So I have some scraps here. And I have some paper clips. Let's do the blue paper clip. Let me see how this looks. And I went ahead and did, did some die cutting. I did that planner planter from um, Urban Gems. And then I also did the butterfly. I think I want to use the butterfly. Yes, I do. Do want to use the butterfly? All right, so let's cut this. Hey, Tracy Boo, let's grab our scissors and then I'm just gonna measure this. I'm gonna eyeball it. Thank God this has lines that I can follow. I'm gonna follow those lines. All right, and then let's cut this. I have a lot of videos on how I make uh, paper clip embellishments. I'm going to link those. It might be like Halloween and stuff, but don't matter. And then let's cut it right there. I lost the place. I think it's this one. Okay. Oh my god, my son eats a whole roasted chicken. Damn girl! He eats four sandwiches and sitting. My son is starting to be a little hungry ass too. Every five minutes, mommy, I'm hungry. I'm like, you just ate an hour ago, Elijah. I'm still hungry. I want something more delicious. That's what he tells me. More delicious. This is too short too short I want to do a blue one um, stay with me guys I'm going to have to switch it up alright let's cut this again You have to make sure that your paper is going to fold over. I'm one of four girls. Never realized how much boys eat. Yes, girl. Me either. But my, my girls be hungry as hell, too. I'm going to have to do a pink uh, paper clip. I want to use this blue. It's pretty. How pretty is this paper? Yes, girl. They're always hungry. I'm just like, God, 
damn. I thought I ate a lot. All right, I'm gonna cut it right there. Okay. Yes. So you just wanna make sure that it's gonna fit nicely in here, okay? See that? Let me use my bow punch. Where did it go? Where did my precious go? Here it goes. Hi, Ray. Oh my God, don't even get me started on dishes. My kids don't like to do dishes for shit. I'm just like, who raised y'all? And then I'm like, oh yeah, me. It was me that raised y'all. There are some lazy kids though, man, for real. They only want to do things when they when they are gonna get something. You know, you guys know what I'm talking about. Like when they want to play the game, and they're like, let's hurry up and clean up real good so mom can let us play the game. It's like, what? Like, don't you guys know that you can get so much money from me if you just do your damn chores? All right. So look at how cute that is. And you don't really see that it's the bows because it's on the side. But I love... the little detail that it makes. I'm going to try to fold it like that. Okay. See? And let's make our little uh, fishtail here. And then have the other one come to the other edge. Just adds a cute little detail. All right, so instead of the blue paper clip, I want to use a pink one. Let me show you guys my a little bit of my paper clip stash. These are all from Dollar Tree. Thank you, Dulce. Let's use a pink one. I got a bright pink one. I like the soft pink one. You guys, when you go to Dollar Tree, grab these. They always have, like, all different kind of colors. I have some muted colors. Like, look at right here. It's a darker. Like, go to Dollar Tree for your paper clips to build your stash. They always have pretty Halloween colors. Like, I love Dollar Tree's uh, paper clips. Yes, Clarissa, I feel like I'm going to the grocery store at least three times a week. And that's just uncalled for. So let me stick my paper clip in here and then we can go ahead and embellish. Just like that. Isn't that pretty? Let's move our scrappy scraps out the way. Let's pick a chain from Craft Upon a Stars kit. Hmm. Let's embellish it first. Cause see, I had this all mapped up and now I done switched it up. Do that butterfly there. Should have been pink. I'm catching myself doing my girl. Yes. What's crazy is my son just turned 15. He's 5'8 and he's the smallest kid on the wrestling team. What the fuck are these moms feeding these boys? <laughs> girl, it's all in the chicken. So let me put some glue on this other die cut and I'm going to double layer this because I like for my butterflies to look like they're flying. Okay, so I'm going to glue that there. Immaculate goes this weekend. I'm hitting Sam's Wally World and Pete's in the mall. Yes, girl. Oh, that sounds good, girl. I haven't used my crock pot in a while. All right. So we'll do it like going to this side. Honestly, I should have used the pink. But we're going to go with it. Because ain't nobody got time for that. 
Let me get some of my tool that I ruffled on my sewing machine. You guys need this tool in your stash. This ain't it. This ain't it. Here it goes. You just need a tiny bit. Let me cut that. One day, my husband bought some fish from this fish place over here on the east side. Uh, and it's, it was so bomb. They're big ass shrimps. So anyways, I ate my food. And I had three shrimps left and some fries. So I put it in the microwave and I said, crumb snatchers, don't touch my damn food. Because they already ate their food, you know what I'm saying? Like they had their own damn shrimps and stuff. What did they do? They ate my damn three shrimps. Three shrimps! They couldn't save three shrimps for their mommy. Three shrimps. Just like, damn. I gotta just like say the opposite of what I want them to do so that they could not do it. Should have said, guys, go ahead and eat my three little shrimps. All right, so I just want that there for texture. I'm going to go ahead and stick this butterfly down. I'm going to pop it up on some foam. What? Mustard on... What? Jess is asking about your punch. Where did you get it? Oh, sorry, girl. I didn't see it. The polka dot pine cone. Monty. Hit her up on Instagram, girl. Tell her you want that bow punch. She might have some left. It was only five bucks, girl. This bow punch is the truth. Sorry, guys. I'm not looking at the chat. Hurry just before the savages get it. By the savages, I mean Devi. I hear mustard on watermelon is good. I'm willing to try it. Five dollar holla, girl. I was like, yes, you coming home with me, girl. All right, let me stick that there. I want it like at an angle. Okay. I'm going to put some foam tape in between these two. Um, <laughs> let us know how it tastes. Laugh out loud. Yeah, Andrea said that it was good. I was like, girl, what the hell? I jumped in her DM like, what the hell, girl? She said it was actually good. The um, bow punch from the polka dot pine cone that I use on these little projects is five bucks. I'm going to do two more on the bottom. Oh, I finally found some cherries. Some red cherries. They're so good. Oh, my God. It was so funny. We went to groceries and I bought cherries. And what else did I buy for Elijah? Damn, what was it? Cherries and I don't know what it was. And he was like, yeah, I can't wait to get home and eat those cherries and whatever else I was I bought for him. <laughs> he was so damn excited. I'm like, yeah, this is my son. He gets excited over food. The border bowl punch is $5. Poochie King show again, yes. This is the bow punch right here, guys. Okay. So what crafts are you guys working on? Guys, if you only have one Poké 2 in your life, you need more because you just got to switch it up. You know what I'm saying, girlfriend? 
You can get some from Ana La Cubana. My friend Debbie, she made the this one for me. For my boho swap, my host gift. Look at how pretty, guys. Why did I think of that? When the kids want to spam, here I go trying to be all chef and make spam with beans and oyster sauce. What the hell? I love spam. I was just talking about that with my friends the other day. Like when we were young and we were broke as hell. Okay, the struggle. Like, you know spam if you know the struggle. We would uh, fry sp uh, spam and put it on a sandwich with um, uh, a little bit of mayonnaise. And it was so good, guys. It was delicious. The most delicious thing ever. Sometimes if we were going to be fancy, we'll put like scrambled eggs. It was so good. I was just talking about that. Your sister, girl, you know your sister's the one that sells the pokey tools? You've never had spam? What the hell? Just... You didn't know the struggle when you was younger, girl? You've got to try Spam. My daughter, she actually, she's 14. She cooks really good. I'm like, damn, girl, show me how you did that. Because <laughs> I don't know how she made it. She made me ramen noodles, right? Ramen noodles, ramen noodles, whatever. Um, with boiled eggs and Spam. Fried Spam in it. And it's the most delicious shit ever. She seasoned it somehow. I don't know what the hell she puts on it. And I was like, damn, I couldn't believe that I, I didn't think that I would ever see the day on where I would ask my 14 year old for a recipe. I'm like, girl, what's the recipe to the spam? Hold on. Okay, I gotta put more glue here because I don't want this moving like this. This is gonna bother me. I never had spicy spam. So stick some glue here. I'm gonna put some more glue here from all this that came apart. Don't judge me, judge your mama. Y'all craft how you wanna craft. Okay. There we go. There we go. Make sure she don't go nowhere. Look at how pretty. Cold spam sandwiches? Like you don't like you don't cook the meat, girl. And I had all three. I just wanted to get veggies in them. Spam musibi is so easy on the go. I love the little keys that you had to open cans with. Oh yeah, girl. Wasn't that the worst shit ever when you lost that key? <laughs> Have y'all ever lost that key? Like, oh shit, how am I gonna get the spam out of here? Okay. That's looking cute. Hmm. I wonder how one of these flowers will look on here. Let's do the pink. Thank you so much, Crafts We Create. What's your name again, hun? Fried Spam and Potatoes. That sounds good, girl. Spam is still expensive, guys. Like, that shit's expensive now. Get out of there. I might use this. Let's see how that looks in the middle. Oh, I love corned beef. One of uh, our like Puerto Rican dishes growing up was corned beef with French fries inside of it, white rice, and corn. Sweet corn. Oh my God, the bomb. I don't know if I want to add this here. You guys tell me what you think about putting that there. I think it's kind of cute though. Get the pliers. I got to open the spam. COVID made spam expensive. I don't know. What the hell? I went to the store. It was like $4. I said, like, what the hell? This can't be um, a struggling food I ate growing up. Let me see what else I got in this box. What do you guys think about that one? Or we can do this. This is my favorite one from the whole entire kit. It's so pretty. Like, how pretty is that? I think we have to go with that. French fries? Yes. No, you take a uh, potato, Noana. Okay, listen, I'm going to put you guys up on game. 
I'm gonna teach you guys how to do which flower should I use first before I forget. This one, the tulip, or this one? I kind of like this one because it has the iridescent. The second one. So look at this is how you do um some Puerto Rican corn beef uh hash or whatever you call it. Um you take some sofrito, okay? If you guys don't know what sofrito is, like get your life together. They sell it everywhere. Sofrito, right? And you season it up. You put your your you mash up your can of corned beef and you season it, okay? You gotta season it, guys. Okay, not just salt. Like you gotta use some adobo, a little bit of pepper, um, a little bit of garlic powder. You season it very well. You take a, a potato and you cut it like french fries and you fry them. You fry french fries and you put it in the corned beef and you, you mix it all together. Not chorizo, girl. Y'all gotta learn. Y'all gotta learn about these things. It's I'm telling you, like, oh my God, these things are delicious. Maybe one day I'll do a video and I'll link everything or some shit. I don't know. But anyways, you do the French fries, right? You fry them, the wedged potatoes, like French fries. And you put it in the hash. You make you a pot of white rice. You make you some corn on the side and you serve it just like that with the rice. You could put the corn hash on top of the rice if you want. And then the corn is so good, guys. It's like savory and sweet. It's just, it's delicious. My Puerto Rican people, if you know, you know. You guys got to try it. I'm telling you, I wouldn't lie to you. I'm going to put the plastic chain on, hanging on the side. Look at how cute. I love this flower star. So beautiful. You can put uh, stickles and diamond dots all around your butterfly to make it all fancy. Thank you, mama. So let's do the chain. Yeah, I think we're gonna use the yellow. The yellow or the white. I'm leaning towards the yellow. This chain is very thick, guys. Thank you, Mama. But you guys have to try that. I'm telling you, it's so delicious. I'm only going to do like... I don't know why I glued this. Damn it. I'm going to do like maybe one, two, three, four. I'm going to do four links. So one, two, three, and then four. Now, these are thick as hell, guys. You have to cut it, okay? And you really do not have to glue it back because it's so thick and sturdy. So use some good scissors. Just clip it like that. See, it's, I'm even going to have to, like, get it out like that. So just little four little rings. I'm going to learn how to make Kentucky wedges. Girl, I really miss KFC wedges. Like, why did y'all do that, KFC? Y'all broke my heart with that one. So the side that we broke, we're just going to clip that on our paper clip. You don't have to glue it back or none of that. Just stick it in there. Y'all know how to stick it in there. a little tricky part because this chain is thick as hell it is strong which i am here for damn it oh duh this side all right here we go Oop. there we go so there goes our little chain and we're just gonna go ahead and hang our little charms. I'm gonna put this one on the bottom. I like that. Let me get a jump ring. So frito is a veggie paste. Yes, it's a base that we use in our cooking. It's basically um, green peppers, onion, a whole bunch of stuff, guys. But we use the base in our rice. We use it for our soups. 
We use it in a lot of dishes. Sometimes in our meats, it has a lot, a lot of flavor. All right, let me get my tools. Yes, you're right, Gabby. Just missed the kid's childhood. Babies won't even know what wedges is. Right. <laughs> you have to get sofrito. If you go to, like, the Spanish parts of, like, Walmart and stuff like that, you can get it in um, a jar form. But, like, if you have a Spanish market, you need to get your ass in there and get it fresh. You can even look online for the recipe. And you can blend it yourself. You just blend all that stuff together and you season it with seasonings. And you can store it in your freezer. It is a stable and Puerto Rican cooking. All right, so let me open this. And let's put this here. Get over here, girl. You guys can hang beads on here. You can do tassels. But I have to include these cute little pieces from my kits. Look at how pretty, guys. So pretty. Yes, girl, we use sofrito on everything. But usually if you go to a Spanish market, they will have it. So I just glued clear bales. You can get these on Pretty Mix Studio. Thank you, mama. Let's put that one. Do I want to put that one there if I already got it on there? No, it's going to bug me. It's going to bug me. Let's just do the charms. Let's do a swan up top, and then I'm just going to do the heart in the middle. Bye, Gloop said. Thanks for stopping in, girl. So let's add one of our swans. I'm going to do a white one. You get a mixture of pink and white swans here. Where's my jump rings? I just took them out. get my life together one day but not today all right okay and i'm just gonna add that on my first one the very first jump ring chain These are so cute, guys. I'm going to right here in the top one. Keep in mind where it's going to hang on the bottom. Like how far it's going to go uh, down. Bye, Lillian. Thanks for stopping in, Mama. Okay. And then let's go ahead and do... A little uh, heart in the middle. Over here. Ooh. I'm surprised you guys are still with me. What? What? But I am loving this kit. It's so pretty. Star, you did such a great job with this kit, girl. Look at how pretty that piece is. Oh, my God. And I really want to do some more stuff with those uh, butterfly appliques. But like I said, I ran out of time. I have a lot of projects that I still need to work on. And I just really wanted to jump on here and show you guys the kit so you guys can snatch it for the launch tomorrow. So make sure you guys hit up Craft Upon a Star. She's right there, uh, Pink Star. She'll get back to you. DM, DM her. Make sure you put a little Night Owl emoji in your message so she knows. Star, you better take care of my Night Owls, girl. Um, right there. Don't be hitting her up all late talking about you didn't get a kit. That's going to be on you. 
tomorrow is the launch for this kit. So jump in her DMs. Bye, Denise. I hope everything's okay over there. Here we go. So here goes our little chain. Let me get my things to lay right. It's annoying when they don't lay right. Sometimes you gotta like turn these around. I'm gonna have to flip this one around. Let me see. I want them to lay like this. There we go. Like these. I look like these. I look like these. There we go. I want those to lay like that. And let me put some diamond dots on the edges. Guys, after this video, Tara, who is Nurse Tara, she's going to be going live on her... Tara, are you still here? Put another one what? Flip the chain. Okay, let me add some diamond dots real quick. While I wait for Tara to answer me. Tara, wake up, Tara. 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 Urban Gems. I'm going to add some diamond dots on the edges. On Instagram, I believe. I'm waiting for her to answer me, guys. Get her ass in here. I know she ain't asleep. Thank you, girl. I feel like it takes me forever. Sometimes I'll be crafting and fucking five hours go by. And I'm like, what the hell? Five hours. She's at Taco Bell. <laughs> so I'm going to add diamond dots. I'm going to do all my gold ones. Because we all know that besides pink, gold is the best color in the world. Okay? I said it. You heard it here. That is a fact. Gold is the best. Nurse Tara, we'd like to place an order for Urban Gems. Look, she, there, there she goes. This one, you can uh, position it, push it down without messing it up. The wax side is to pick them up, and then the other tip is to place, to like, you know, secure them. See, like this one is um, it's crooked, so you just use it to press it down. Tara, are you still going live? Did she say no? Let me see. Yes, yeah, she did. She said no. Terry, not going live. Girl, don't be acting like you didn't tell me you were gonna do a video. Don't play with me. Are you doing like a uh what do you call the other thing? You know what, Nurse Tara 04? So I'm just going to place all gold. Y'all do what you want to do. Embellish your uh, paper clip embellishments how you want. A video. Okay, well, whatever. Um, The video that you're going to do, are you going to do the... I forgot what it's called. The premiere. Don't come over here talking about that's cute after you told me you was going to do a live. Okay, I like that. Should we put one in the middle? No, we don't want to mess that up. All right, so that is our paper clip, guys. Isn't it pretty? Oh, so pretty. I got to turn this around. 
fucking with me. He turns around. Thank you guys. Such a damn liar. Trying to make me seem like the liar. That's some shit. And they're gonna believe I'm the liar too. Let me see if I can flip this. So make sure you guys go jump in once upon craft upon a star Instagram. And get this kit. All right, guys. All my night owls. I need you guys to support my girl. Her small business. This kit is lit. It's litty like a titty. Look at how pretty, guys. I like it. I think I like it. I think I need to, like, add something here. But I'm not going to do it right now. And I love this little bow punch from Monty. I love the texture of the tool. Let's move everything so we can recap. So bomb. Thank you for sharing. You're welcome, girl. Just a miscommunication. <laughs> All right. So let's clear some of this up. So if you guys missed the kit, um, check the beginning of the replay of this video. Because I will show you guys everything that's in this kit. But let's just recap on what I made for my design team projects. Okay. Uh, once again, this is Craft Upon a Star's kit. It is $55 shipped, and it is worth every fucking penny, okay? It is fully loaded. You're not going to get a little sample pack. You're getting, like, the full, okay, like a set of, I don't know how many charms are in there, more than 10 probably. So we got these paper clip embellishments that we just made. We have this one with a little planter. Both of these dies you can get at Urban Gems, Okay. Look at how cute that is. Oh, I love it. We made some of these shaker envelopes with the tool. Little cabochons. And then inside is housing a little mini memory dex card. Look at how cute. So cute. Okay. You can put whatever you want in here. If you're making one for me, you can put some money in there. Cash only. I prefer $20 bills and up. We made this one. This is the one I made previous. I used a little tulip. And there's a little mini memory dex card. Isn't it cute, guys? Oh, I love this butterfly chipboard. It's so pretty. Look at how cute. Okay, we made those. And then last but not least, I just uh, went ahead. I did do some of this trim, ruffled some trim with the tool. Thank you, guys. Did you put any interfacing to the tool? I don't know what that means, Luana. I'm so new to the sewing girl. I don't know what that is. No, I just put the tool directly in there, and I just ruffled it. I have a video on how I did it. I don't know, one. I'm sorry. And then this is the embellishment box. This comes in the kit, guys. It is pink, and it's adorable. These little pretty appliques. I put a chipboard, the trim that I ruffled. And you guys can uh, put whatever you want in here. I'm not going to judge you on what you put in here. You do what you want. But that's it, guys. All right, guys. I love you guys so much. I hope that you guys enjoy. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. Look at how cute they look together. It looks like a nice little set. I love it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Somebody take a picture of this for me. For my thumbnail. Okay. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I'm going to link all the videos I mentioned. I'm going to have to watch the replay. I'm going to insert timestamps. So if you guys want to go back and just check out the kit. Or if you want to go back and see how we did the paper clips or whatever. And I hope that you guys have a great night. Okay? Bye, guys. I love you guys. Hootie hoo.